James <laughs> just got hard bowed. Speaking of getting hard bailed, let's see if uh, I might have to leave soon. Same. I don't know if I'm in wave one or two. Alright stream, I'm out of here. Gotta go play my pool. Have fun uh, watching this monkey business. Hey, what's going on? What we got Grand Finals Game 2. Looks good, Talented City. The DLC. Not a bad stage for them, of course. Uh, blue team taking a bit of damage right away. Don't want that. Little team combo there. Palatine is getting messed up. Could be it. No, nope. Buffalo cells. 
but size and was in trouble. But yeah. <laughs> the, I'm, I'll use that witch time combo. Despite all the damage. Well, I almost commentator cursed him, but despite all the damage, Hive is still there. Uh, but red team. Really looking very safe right now. That up, wow, I, I'm surprised that, oh, I saw that rage on Palutena, okay. Going off, got the footstool, didn't take a jump or anything though, so I was no trouble coming back. Size having to contend with this Bayonetta heel sliding. The limit blade beam still not killing Palutena. She's not the lightest character in the game, clearly. Ooh, but back air will do it. Most of the way to the right. <laughs> Reflectoring sigh. I'm not sure that was the intention. It seemed to help him out. Guys, this is Jim Clone, by the way. I don't know if anybody's in chat. Oh, sorry, and I have almost got some combo. <laughs> Just shooting guns at him. Oh, well, we're gonna get an air dodge read. That up smash super powerful. In a it stays strong for that whole linger hitbox. The weak parts are only dependent on where you get hit by it. And they're not that weak, just the same. <laughs> oh, but that sacrificial up B on the way down. I'm gonna take Percy's first stock, but take I with him. Got a little bit of slide neutral. Looks like I might get a partner here on commentary. Yep, this is going to be YJ Cooper joining Jen Coleman on commentary for hey. Grand Finals. And it looks like we got a reset. Uh, it doesn't have an L or a W over there, but Cy and Hive were in winner's side. Okay. I think, I think it's just the first set. Okay. And we have it confirmed that this is indeed the first set. And we have a limit on being taking that stock. <laughs> They're doing, doing a pretty good job of that. That's the second time that uh, Percy's just taken the witch time and, and making it his kill. And as good as a defensive player Hive is, this is going to be very difficult for him to make this 2v1 happen. Yeah, it's pretty tough. Bayo has no damage. but And that Nair is going to clear it out. And we are going to go to a game three, tying it one to one. Not bad, not bad. Now, I saw most of the first set they played. Cells of Percy never actually went their mains. I'm not real sure what that was about. But this time, they're serious mode. Yeah. Do they but not Percy. enjoy this team in doubles, perhaps? <laughs> maybe, maybe not. Yeah. Per Percy likes to have fun sometimes. I don't know. I can respect that. I usually that. see Cells go off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Cells normally yeah, sticks to the tried and true. They're taking it serious now. Back to town and city. They and it was uh, red team's counter pick. Now it's blue team's counter pick. I can see both teams really liking Town and City throughout the majority of this set. Uh, it ain't bad. You get that Diddy Kong up throw to Palutena up air. It'll die at like 70. Classic Thai and Hive combo. Let's see. Ooh. Oh. Almost had a double, but one he didn't Bayonetta want, but he almost. Bayonetta almost falling out of her combo and into the waiting up air from Hive. Hot. <laughs> almost point. got that air dodge read on the ground. Another air dodge read. Really likes those. You gotta watch out. He really got, and he's very good at getting them. And the and Two like we said, back to back, down, up, up throw, throw, into up air. And the pivot grab into Nair, very nice. And into the back air, very good conversions coming out from the blue team. Yeah, that back air has it all for Palutena. It has range, it has invincibility, it is... It, it hurts. It's, and it's powerful, yes. It is a very good move on a not-so-great character, yeah. No. Well, we've got a re-grab, gonna scoop him with the dash and attack. And the dash attack not going to seal it out, yeah, though. no rage on cloud. Very true. <laughs> so going for both up air? Oh, not quite. Heel slide having... High being at too much... Having too much percent for that heel slide to connect into any more conversions. <laughs> just, just blade beam in his blade face. Blade beam in the face. Yep. Just let it rip. Let's go. That'll be enough. 
170 damage, all with the up air. And living the good. up air, really Very magnificent DI. Uh, going for that corner. And now they are harassing. Percy is the cloud, correct? Yeah. They are harassing Percy on the ledge. Getting down aggressively with that down air, and the back air going to catch on. Sells on the ledge. Yes. <laughs> and right Percy. into the waiting arms of Percy. Yeah, Percy does a pretty decent job of that. You know, Sells misses Creating some of trap. Yeah, he misses some of his combo, and Percy will just knock him off and right back into it. You know, oh, you missed your second witch twist. Well, here, try this. Oh, and the air, air dodge read again. He didn't land on ground that time, but it was enough. Just charge it up, kill him at 100. I've even had the read that he was going to drift slightly behind him and had the wherewithal Ooh. to jump cancel and turn it into the opposite direction. Cloud down smash at ledge will kill fairly, somewhat early. You know, Palatine was only at 100 after the hit. They even nerfed cloud down smash, didn't they? I think Don't they nerfed recall. the strength a little bit. Might have. Because I feel like I remember Ned complaining about that <laughs> once. <laughs> because pre-patch it would have killed in a situation. And after the set, it was he said, of all the things to nerf, why down smash? Yeah, they nerfed a few things. Oh, and, and the up smash going to take it. Sai going to convert off of his partner there. Hitting everybody. Killing only one. Double up air. And he Just chased him into the sky for that. <laughs> Just do it. <laughs> Team Sai Hive hugging it out over here. Yep. Pretty, pretty hype. Scary part of that, if he whiffed, I'm pretty sure Adair would have sent him just enough into the air for it to kill him off the top. Oh uh, yeah, if he had got hit by the the hit of a down air, or oh, you say, or down air or up air maybe. Yeah, down air. If down air didn't yeah. spike, it would send him up or yep. up air possibly if he got below him. Yep. And now for game four, we are going to go to Smashville. Four. This is Psy and Hives. Chance to win it all. Mm -hmm. Chance to close it out. And now Sells and Percy are in the situation where they have to win two in a row to get this reset. Not even to win grand final, just to get the reset. Not opting to go to Town and City this time. They were not enjoying the up airs from oh, Diana, uh, Palutena. I think they were approaching maybe almost every stock, I think, was lost just to Palutena up there. Uh, they were, a lot of them were lost to Palutena up something, up smash, up air. Yeah. Back air at one point. One, one time in particular, Diddy up smash. Oh, wow. Sells with the catch, but couldn't finish it off. Palatina already approaching very dangerous percents, especially against these two characters. Palatina approaching very dangerous rage, however. Very true. One up air. You definitely can't discount. You, in doubles in general, you can't discount any sort of stock until it's gone. But very especially true. right and there. And there we go. <laughs> Just a stock charge is not it. over until it is gone. Charge it up. Fire covers the entire half of the stage. Well, that side. My and goodness. the back are going to close it out. The threat of the F smash <laughs> in the opposite direction. Percy Holt, another air dodge read, but this one will not kill. Up air, but Bayonet on <laughs> at very low percent. It's not going to close it out even remotely. Percy Limit using that wavy. Cover his uh, recovery. Dash attack not yet going to close it out. Holding on to this stock. One thing, one of the many things Zai is good at in doubles, he will survive for long periods of time. Even that stock, I believe he lived past 150? Ooh, I think he died right at 150. Okay. But yeah, he is a great stock tank and high, very safe player. They Another great stock tank here is Percy. Also, true. living at 159. 170. Not um, able to get. Very unfortunate. I wonder yeah. if maybe Nair would have done, but dash attack straight up, probably trying to di in. Yeah, but it would have killed. And Nair is going oh, to take high stock. And now we have a dead even ge game. One player at two, one player at one for both teams now. There, now it's <laughs> within 10 percent even. All told. Yep. This is this game is going to come down to the wire, but this bayonetta. Bayonetta combo not going to close it out just yet. Couldn't land that up there. Wouldn't have killed. Could have got even more juggle, uh, perhaps. Mm -hmm. 
Sounds like off. a bit of the switcheroo, hitting one opponent and then monkey flipping at the other. Forward throw causing a disruption of a hive jab combo. So I trying to find that uh, that F smash. Just trying to find that answer, doing a little ledge cancel monkey flip, throw things off. Ooh, that <laughs> Cells was expecting a follow up on that banana, but side just And the back are going to take goodness. it, and now Cells has to share stock. Backhand him with the shield. Mm -hmm. I was kind of going a little. No oh, he hit his own partner. Why did he? Oh, that was so close. Yeah, although potentially he could have hit them both, but I don't know if Diddy Kong would have died. And then they're gonna and kill his own partner. It's, he's got a stock to spare. He's mm -hmm. not bleeding too hard just yet, unless he gets hit by a finishing touch, perhaps. But they haven't landed any of those that I can see now. Apart from this. the one. Uh, in yeah, game uh, two, I believe. Yeah, Percy landed one raw, but I don't know if... I believe he converted one Bayonetta's off of... Bayonetta's not going for a Bayonetta's whole lot of, which like, rows. Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, that's what it was. Game one. The forward throw, not gonna kick it. Percy is gonna... Actually, now both of them are gonna have to play incredibly safe. Oh, no! It is not going to take Hive stock. Very good. Hive living. Oh, he wanted to back throw. He, he just... Both of them looking for their there. throws. Now, High should be trying to take point here, but Bayonetta is a little slippery. Might not be able to. Tried to witch time the banana on the ground, but Sai or, uh, si already picked it up. Sai has a nasty history of having his bananas uh, countered at times, though. Doing it again. It did get countered, but he wasn't close enough to be uh, affected. However, is the fair train going to take? Not, not quite. Not enough rage. The sparks lied. That's always one mechanic of Smash I've always wondered when the sparks actually come out. Yeah, it's 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 factoring something. It's not considering most DI though. Okay, not. Oh, it's probably considering like training room DI then. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I've tried to catch Bayo coming down on him. Not enough. Very good wherewithal. Oh no! Oh, that could have been just awful. <laughs> if Cells if getting the work got in there with the back air. Ooh, the back throw is going to take it. No team combo necessary, just back throw. And with that, Cyan Hive 3 1 will take grand finals. Good stuff. They're pretty happy about it. Yeah. <laughs> Double specialists, always good to see them succeed. Oh, yeah, they're, they're pretty good static from way back. Oh, yeah. Were they a static team in Brawl? Mm, I don't. I think so. I don't really know how, if I was very far in Brawl. Yeah. And now that I, uh, I know Sai and it, Sai and Daisha play a Daisha, lot. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So uh, next up, we're probably gonna have some pools. Yeah, we might have to wait just a bit for a um, singles pools match to start. Yeah, we gotta get somebody going here. I don't know if they have. Them kind of selected and scheduled out, or they're just going to throw up whoever becomes available. But wave Probably A, wave A will be coming around. You're in wave B as well, I, I assume? I am in wave B. Nice. Yep. There, a lot of killers from Kentucky, Indiana, and Ohio all came to this event. Well, oh, yeah. those that did not attend SmashCon, at least. <laughs> yeah. Say that the Ohio Rosalinas are over at SmashCon. Yep. Uh, uh, Crazy Colors, I believe, actually teaming with the Buzz, if I recall correctly. Hmm. I don't know. I didn't watch that. Yeah. But I know the uh, Buzz attended their Columbus Weekly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's kind of goofy because uh, like doubles was supposed to start at about 11. Mm -hmm. They were kind of kind of waiting around, just in general, you know, people yeah. streaming in. Also, getting, some the getting the venue more set up, and also like 20 Indiana people <laughs> were coming in late, yep. <laughs> which was like half the teams. Yup, literally everybody from Indiana was on a team except like three people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if Percy hadn't shown up, uh, Rip and I would have gotten buys mm -hmm. into winner semifinals. <laughs> Goodness. So yeah, very thankful that. Who was all in the carpool? Percy sells. Uh, that one, I'm not sure. Per Percy sells spooks. I don't think he had a teammate. I don't okay. know. Uh, Cropso. 
Uh, but then the other one that was almost as late was Rusky, Vemzer. Yep. Mm, a few others. Definitely some, definitely a lot of killers at this tournament, a lot of up and comers, and I'm hoping to see some good upsets today. I'm hoping to see some good quality oh, yeah. Smash 4. We had some of that last time. I particularly remember, uh, is from Underman here? I thought I heard his name. I I keep forgetting what he looks like. But I like think last he's getting bodied by work. <laughs> but last all mid when from Underman took out Rusky in pools. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> With Pac Man, all Pac Man. Yeah, I do remember him uh, in a couple of chats talking about that because he was <laughs> that day he was just not feeling bayonetta and wanted to have some fun with his Pac-Man. Mm -hmm. Not too devastating because you know, I think I think it just about everybody made it out winners side pools mm -hmm. in that one. I don't know how they're doing it this uh, this time around. I think it's top three make it out. All right. <laughs> He was like, uh, everybody, the whole crowd was there, and I was on the stream, and I was trying to style, and then he just, like, kept, <laughs> and then for running man just threw fruit at me. <laughs> like, it's like, my banana's the only fruit that's supposed to be on the stage. Or he got caught by food. Tramp. He got, he was, a. Uh, yeah, he was trying to do Diddy Barrels and got caught by the trampoline, and, like, the, the hitbox of it when he first makes it, and it just, like, Tumbled him it knocked really him out of barrels. <laughs> it just like really slowly tumbled him away. That is amazing. Because I was, because at first I thought he was going for the trampoline, and then he got, he just kind of tumbled and died, and I was, <laughs> okay. okay. I guess one you don't see very often. Mm -hmm. Let's, see. Let's see. There are four pools. There's one. Wait, is he playing in that pool? I thought he was just a captain. All right, then. I believe the captains are also in the pools. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Some of the competitors we have going in the pools, we have Jark, Wood, TCMK. I know Marsh is currently in Wave A. So you don't have anybody, like, scheduled or anything? I don't hey, believe Forrest, so. Hey, Forrest, you have an opponent? You have an opponent? Oh. Him? Yeah. Okay. Sounds like the idea is going to be Vorst and Butter. What's that? Yeah. Get the Indiana V Kentucky right away. Who's that? Ah. Oh no, butter. What's happening? <laughs> well, they were gonna put butter and forest on, but butter was still walking towards butter the venue. Butter just got here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, my bad. <laughs> That's all right. We can wait. There's plenty of other pools. I assume it's round robin. I thought butter was just on his way to the bathroom. <laughs> oh well. You can always play later. Yeah. But for now, we are going to have Marsh, Marsh the Wario and another guy. I'm almost positive I know his Not tag, Indiana. but I cannot remember. <laughs> I believe it's Kentucky. Let's see. But we are going to have Dark Samus. Let's go. Definitely an interesting matchup. I think it's going to boil down to... Quite simply, um, Bane. Black Bane? Or BLK Bane? I'm going to call him Bane. Yeah. Well, right Black off, going to get chomped on a bit by uh, Wario Marsh. Uh, notorious Wario main. Going to have to watch that shield. A lot of pressure coming out from Bane. Not able to convert on the falling up air, though. <laughs> Almost catching him with the up smash. Samus has surprising shield pressure. Partic like, a very he gets that... Uh, charge shot ready to go then any straight hit and you can get a shield broke on the ledge it is scary how much pressure she can put on and the corkscrew going to get him out of the situation yeah gonna kind of just cover the up air on shield with and i believe tcmk 
I believe he just upset Wood, yes. Ooh, so we have our first upset of the day. Let's see if our other Wario right here on stream can do a little better. Very true. We I'd love to know if he went Wario or Game and Watch. That's true. Depends on the matchup, of course. Mm -hmm. Also, just who he's feeling that day sometimes. <laughs> Shot the missile the wrong way, but the bomb helps out. Yep, main. bomb is always a homie. Well, so he's not. I don't know if he's maybe is it getting enough time that he's not charging his shot like at all. I think he's too worried about uh the threat of auto cancel back air. Yeah. And very nicely getting through that bike setup. Let's see. The scary thing about Wario is once he has the bike on stage, you have to. Pick an option to get around the bike, because if you attack the bike, Wario, more often than not, can react to whatever option you picked. Yeah, he can cover nearly anything when you're on that bike. You just have to... Oh, especially if he has full waft on deck. And you got to take a second to wait and consider what he's going to try. Not taking the time to set up a bike, though. Interesting. Mario's getting his... Got his waft fully on deck here. More than Still like has to finish up this stock, though, and this Sam is getting a little squirrely on him. Mm -hmm. More than likely, he's... I believe he's planning to... Uh, save... <laughs> the little baby charge, yeah. Yep. Let him know. I believe he's going to save the block for the second stock, and hopefully close it out at... And the that, fair going to take it. Yeah, that should be the usual Wario idea. Like, you don't use your waft on, on the first your, stock, yes. On their first stock or your first stock, unless you just really can't think of another and way. And the to Samus do it. F Smash is just going to seal smash. out Marsh. Just catch him with that fire fist. Ooh, just hopping around with a bomb. Oh, I thought we were going to see a footstool combo. I was getting hyped. <laughs> Wario's footstool combos are nuts. They're. Insanely scary. You can they do tons of damage, and with that waft on deck, they could potentially kill. Mm -hmm. If he could get him to the side, I believe mm. at this percent, yeah, I believe he's dead. If he gets hit by a full charge waft, let's this see. Sam is bringing it back. He's keeping it even. And if he, you know, last 160 percent again, no bike. But not going to be able to cover. Yeah, not quite as aware of his own bike setups. Mm -hmm. A little missile barrage, mixing up them normals and supers. I believe he tried to catch him with an up smash, but the uh, screw attack on it. Ooh, just the F smash on him. Getting a little bit too antsy. The F smash getting punished with land the on him pushing buttons. And Bane laughing. He, he knows. Kinda, he kind of clap, clasped hands with him. He's like, yo, he mm -hmm. whopped it on me. You really can't get mad at that one. That's just. You getting a little bit too antsy, yeah. wanting the aggression. Are we going to see a potential character switch from Bane? Definitely looks like he's thinking. He's thinking about it. The only really thing uh, I want to see different is just more charge shot. Just having the, ch you don't have to use it. Just charge mm -hmm. it up and get that for that flashing on your body to yeah. scare your opponent. <laughs> you don't want to get hit by a 25% charge shot. Oh no, scare so. him into shield, get the grabs, and also dash attack. Oh yeah, dash attack, super disjointed, pretty safe on a late hit. Mm -hmm. Crosses up shield a lot. Let's see, jumping so over the charge stuck shot, with already Samus. getting a bite. I'm going to go with the flat stage, classic zone character uh, counter pick. I would Both. say this is good. <laughs> Both hits in there coming out from March. There's dash tech. We got combos. There we go. Get those bread and butter combos. And landing on him with the bike. With the bike. Throwing the bike at him. The bike itself does 14 or 15. So it's a it's a decent little projectile of its own. And the but reset. Mm, little holding slow. it just a little bit too long. So I can't say nothing. I I suck at jab resets myself. Oh, so do I. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I get one, I. It's just like you forget the timing. You practice it all the time, and you want you run, to have the timing. You run up there, you do some Luigi upbeat. You hear that coin come out, and you're like, "Well, your turn, I guess." <laughs> I try. I deserve whatever you're coming at me with. You can. You couldn't do anything. <laughs> One O Marsh. 
Ooh, got him with the forward throw. Hip check. Not gonna do it. Not gonna kill. Where did he throw him on the stage? <laughs> At the edge. Surprisingly. I'm not sure if his forward throw or his back throw is better. Forward. See, I always get confused because in Brawl, I believe his forward throw was the spin throw. Oh, really? <laughs> if I'm remembering right. And the down smash going to send in the wrong direction and not take out that stock. He and the late hit crazy. Fair. Oh, he's got rage now. <laughs> the anti air F smash. We're gonna. Oh, he's got the charge shot now. And you see, this is a very dangerous situation now because if he can read Marsh getting read onto Marsh. his bike. But. Oh, he's. His own bike stopped him. And the bike is going to save Black Vane's stock. I'm going to say, any whiffed uh, back throw? But the back throw is not going to kill. Confirmed. Back throw much worse than forward Back throw, throw is to... Oh. oh, no tech coming out from Vane. No tech. That's a tricky one, because it could throw him the other way and you just die. Yes. Because it's, it's fairly strong down there. But not out of it yet. Vane just needs to get that hit. He just has to take the stock and then play very safely around Marsh's walk. One good guess. One good, uh... Oh, up tilt? The up, up tilt. tilt is going to take it! And I believe the taunt coming out as well. Pew. I can honestly say I think that's the first time I've ever seen a Samus up tilt kill. Oh, that was a really interesting uh, little pressure situation. Had the bomb and then up tilted at him. <laughs> Both up tilts. Oreos and Samus's. Ooh. The DI? The DI is real though. I think he just DI'd left, but it was enough. Samus is in, has got a big heavy power suit on. Mm -hmm. the, the one jab, because Samus's jab is very unfortunate. Marsh definitely wanted the <laughs> other side of that hit though. Trading down air with back air. Got him off him, but he uh, doesn't want to take damage. Here comes the setup. Not, not going enough. to take it though. Not fast enough. Now Marsh has got to rack up damage. And right Dude. now, oh, charge very shot. Very nice charge it. shot. Oh, yeah. Made his landing safe. And now this is where it's set up again. things <laughs> start getting tricky for Wario. <laughs> he needs to either get a forward for throw at a kill <laughs> percent. As many pummels as he could get. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he was intending to ever throw. I don't Just believe probably so. Probably not wanting to stale it. Exactly. His other throws really don't give him too much advantage. Yeah, down throw would have given him stage control. Back throw would have given him stage control. Up throw doesn't have any conversions at that percent. Just a very rough spot. Probably pummeling is the best option. Going to shield that. Gotta watch it. Oh, that was really that was of, very dangerous on Marsh's part. But this bike setup might take the set. I'm gonna wait for it to stop bouncing. Good roll on. Right in time to not to the up air. On. Dash tech trade bike with and bike. Trade. Not the worst trade. Very dangerous situation. I believe at that percent, Forrest was definitely would have killed. He was at for sure going for another dash attack into that bike. Got the bomb to cover himself. Forward throw. Gonna that is going to take the set. <laughs> <laughs> a very entertaining and a very competitive set coming out from this wave one of pools. Quite close games. I'm excited to see what Bane does in the rest of his pool. You want to keep going? Would you like to sell? I'd like to, yeah. Alright. Never mind. I'm the other one. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, we are going to have Jankholm stepping off commentary for a little bit. And we are going to be joined by one half of the doubles grand champions. Right. There you go. Is it? Are we good? Hi. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is Sai, uh, commentating all mid, the second regional. Wait, where is this the second? Third? Today's regional. It's the second. second. This, okay, the second regional. <laughs> um, very fortunate to have won doubles earlier. Um, kind of flushed it. High was definitely carrying stuff. Uh, but I'm Hive I, was popping off with some of those up air chases. Hive, he got some some ridiculous stuff. He got like <laughs> a double up air and it killed it like 60 or something. Yep. He, some, he killed Cloud at Cloud percentages and I was just, I was shook. <laughs> Happily shook. I gave him a hug mid-set and everything. Yep. It's not about me. It's about this pool's match. It doesn't exist yet. Indeed. 
but I'm sure soon enough we will have a match. I think. Can somebody play it? Oh, there we go. Oh, and we've got Marsh stepping back onto the set. Let's go. All right, we got Marsh and we got Silent. Uh, where's, does anyone know Silent is on the set PR? He is. He is. Marsh has been doing uh, incredible lately. Um, he really is. He just won the previous match and he went through a couple of majors and did really well. I think he got 49th mm -hmm. at. Uh, Marsh, what was that thing you went to? You got like 49th at out in California? What? what was that major you went to? You got like saga. arm saga. Arm saga. Yes, it 49th was. 49th at arm saga, which is incredibly difficult. Mm -hmm. So, um, teaching everybody the Wario matchup that doesn't know it from wood already, basically. Unless you live in Georgia, you 